Okay, a few people have asked me about the um, spotlights that I've got on the front um, versus the standard lights of the Aveco Daily. Well, look, I don't know what you can see now on the screen, probably not a great deal. That's very similar to what I can see, which is not a great deal. So these lights at the moment are on dip and I'll flick them onto high beam. That high beam that you're seeing now is the high beam of the Iveco Daily four-wheel drive without any spotlights on and um, without the HID conversion that travel trucks do which I'm tempted to get but since I've put the spotties on I probably won't. So I've got a couple of um, HID spotlights with internal ballast on the front made by um, Ironman four-wheel drive and I'll flick them on now sure you can probably see the difference. The difference is night and day for me. I don't know how that'll translate on the screen. I think they're 55 watt. I don't know. Can't remember. But they're actually um, really, really good. The only problem that I find with HID lights driving on remote roads and, you know, in the night time is that when a vehicle's approaching you and you've got to dip them, you go from super good vision you know, as you're seeing now, you know, well and truly lit up for the best part of a kilometre down the road and then you see a vehicle come and you dip your lights and you go back to this and it's like, holy cow, where am I going? You can't really see a thing, but um, I guess the good thing about driving in the Northern Territory is at night, you don't really see that many vehicles coming at night, so not the issue that but anyway, I just thought I'd try and show you what my lights are like and I'm very, very happy with them. Catch you later.